sent you on in your video analysis obviously setup plays a huge part in how you're going to turn into the backswing so what we see with your setup is that the hips sit back a little bit and the spine sits slightly forward with quite a bit of neck tilt here in a dress now the problem with that type of setup is that your first movement is going to be to move to the side with the hips so we create a little bit of sway in that backswing rather than a good turn and that's the catalyst for what happens in your backswing as soon as we see that little sideways movement your recovery is to try and roll the arms around the club gets a bit flat in the backswing and then from there it's basically full-on recovery mode so what we're going to do here is we're going to talk through kind of three simple things that you can do to start off with improving that and improving the, the kind of plane of the club going back and the first thing is going to be just the setup so really simple what i want you to do is get into a setup i want you to pop the club just on the front of your chest bend into the golf ball and just create a little bit of a push to the left so you'll notice there the kind of club just touches the kind of inside of my left knee and that really gets my left hip a bit more over my left ankle and it creates a slight tilt with my spine and as soon as you've done that what you will probably feel is even on my right foot there's a little shift of pressure to the inside of my right foot and that's going to be a really important feeling as we start to work into the backswing the second part the turn so from that setup it should be as i said much easier to then feel a bit of pressure in my right foot and actually hold that pressure on the ground while i push my right hip backwards so you'll see the drill that i've set up here is i've basically got an alignment stick about an inch away from my right leg so what i can do with that is i can start by making just little light swings into that good setup a little rotation of my hip and up to the top of the back swing. and that's really the first thing that i want you to start to think of in swing is just can i get a little rotation back with my right side now the way you're going to do this in practice is very slowly and very lightly so we're going to go into the setup we're going to get a little bit of that tilt that we spoke about and as we turn back we're going to try and feel like the inside of my right foot is staying strong on the ground back swing nice and slow and we're going to just stop around about shoulder high so let's give that a little shot now so into setup we're going to start with a nice turn just nice and slow stop and swing through so we're really just working that rotation in the swing and trying to train you to to use the ground and use your hips correctly in the backswing the final little drill that we're going to do is just to help you kind of maintain that structure so we can kind of go about this exactly the same way and even do this drill in the process but what we're going to do is we're going to do a little drill where we keep the hands down and we make a turn going back and we push 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 our arms away so you'll see my right arm hasn't had the opportunity to fold in behind me now that's one of the things that we also seen in your golf swing so again i'll have the stick right up next to my leg i'll have the same little setup and i'm just going to push my hands away and try and keep the hands pushing 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 as i turn into that backswing again stopping at shoulder high so we can then bring that feeling into an actual shot so again same setup hip about an inch away from the stick pushing the club away just going nice and slowly into the backswing pushing 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 stop there and hit through so it's just to begin to create a little bit of width in that right arm and really help you feel like you're turning correctly rather than using the arms to get the club back Thank you.